Welcome to the online demonstration of carbon dioxide snow cleaning brought to you by Applied Surface Technologies. Carbon dioxide snow cleaning is a unique surface cleaning process in that it can remove hydrocarbons and particles of all sizes at the same time. The key points of this cleaning process is first, particle removal range. It's from visible down to three to five nanometers as verified by atomic force microscopy and we have that discussion on the website. The mechanism involves not only a flowing gas for larger particles, but momentum transfer, so the submicron down to nanometer sized particles. It's, this is discussed on our website at co2clean.com slash frequently asked questions or FAQ. The second key point is hydrocarbon removal. It's by a solvency based mechanism and it's discussed at the same site. Third, key point. It's a quick process with no chemical waste, no residues. The last point and very important point that's non-destructive to your sample. CO2 snow cleaning only has the ability to remove physically bound materials by Van der Waal forces or other weak forces. Anything at contamination that's ionic, covalently, metallically bonded will stay. Even chem absorbed molecules will stay. This implies that thin films are deposited on substrates will stay if they are properly deposited and have the proper bonding to the substrate. So we'll discuss applications next. There are many applications over a wide range and they're discussed on the website. We have three separate application pages for unique areas of time across microscopy, art, and telescope mirrors. But we also discuss cleaning optics, all kinds of optics, substrates of all kinds. Also, you, it, this process is used to clean analytical samples, especially for X-ray for electron microscopy and for atomic force spark microscopy. Also, it cleans vacuum parts, vacuum systems. It cleans electron guns, ion guns. The key is that it can remove particular contamination and actually reduce arcing on high voltage equipment. So on to our equipment. The basic unit and the most important part is the Venturi nozzle. It's an asymmetric Venturi and it's unique to our company. We, it allows for operation with liquid CO2 feed or CO2 gas feed. It's unique in the industry. Uh, the rest of the uh, parts of the equipment are kind of standard, on-off device hoses. We also make a high purity unit that uses electro-polished valve for on-off control. We have a solenoid-based unit for essentially automatic or semi-automatic operation. It operates off a 24 volt DC half amp. We also have these astronomy-based units where it's the basic unit with a different type of nozzle and a long tube that allows for stabilization of a stream that could travel many feet. This stream, you know, except the one inch it spreads, and we also have made two and four inch slot nozzles that allow for cleaning large optics. This unit has been able to clean a large eight meter telescope mirror in about 20 minutes. So let's go to a demonstration range. Uh, first, we're going to demonstrate the high velocity CO2 for precision cleaning. Here, we form a stream with very small dry ice traveling at high velocity, and when it hits the surface, it cleans the surface. This demonstration is shown on our website further down the page on examples from this demo talk. The last demonstration I'm going to show is the astronomy unit. Here we're trying to create a stream that has low velocity dry ice and will travel a great distance and it looks like this. And I would like to thank you for your time and your interest.